It's Pro Reader Q from Plastic Logic. Seven millimeters thin. Large 10.7 inch display. Full capacitive touchscreen operation. The product has two buttons. It has a home button here and a power button here. Connectivity is either by micro USB, Wi Fi, Bluetooth, or 3G. I'll show you some of what the device can do now. So this is really an e-reader targeted at uh, business professionals. So people are going to use this not just for leisure reading, but use it as part of their job. And a couple of things that are really key for those folks are the ability to sync your calendar from uh, Exchange Outlook with the device. And so you can get your appointments on there. If the appointment has an attachment in it, that comes over as well. And so you can keep track of what's going on in your day. The second thing that's really good is that if you have a BlackBerry and somebody sends you a message on your BlackBerry, you can use uh, put an app on your phone and then Bluetooth the uh, attachment over and then you can take a look at it. You know, Q is intelligent. It knows the orientation for content when you pull it up. So we'll open up a uh, PowerPoint presentation here. And it's going to know that it should be in landscape mode. So it'll come up in landscape mode, no tricks, just does it all by itself. And then you can look at the, the presentation. You can move forward through it. Tell you what page it's going to. You can either do the double tap like I did, or you can you know hit the page advance. And then once you're done with that, you can go back to the home screen. We have a number of tools to make reading on the device simpler. So we'll open up an Excel spreadsheet. And you'll be able to see that you know some of the numbers on this are, you know, maybe 10 years ago I thought they were big, but not so much anymore. And so I can you know, magnify and zoom in. And it'll allow me then to be able to, to read the material and you can scroll side to side or up and down so you can see the part that you want. And then when you're done looking at the big view, you can go back to the regular view. You can also do annotations on the device. So you can do things, you can add maybe some pre-configured stamps, so if you had questions about something, you could just put that where you want it to on the device. You can do drawing, you can do highlighting, and then if you decide you don't like what you put down, you can erase it. So maybe I decide that I think you know, this is important. If I put a circle around it and I think about it a little more, well, maybe not so much. Now, one of the things we've worked with a number of our partners in the publishing industry, so newspapers, magazines, was something called Q True View. And what that does allows them to have more control over how their content is presented to their customer. So I have an example on here of today's USA Today. So what this does, it has you know, the look and feel that the publisher wants for their content. And so you know, it's set up in a couple of columns in this example. Um, all of its touch operation you know, maintains the graphics that they want to have with their content. You, know, you navigate around, you move to an article, you move to that page. This is a short article. If it was a longer article, you could page forward, page back. Go back to the main section and you can see the, the content. Now we've got a number of publishing partners who we announced today. Um, if you were at our booth, uh, one of the walls in the booth got a lot of them listed on it. We have two versions of the device. One has uh, Wi-Fi, USB, Bluetooth, and 4 gig of memory, and it's 649. And the second version is 3G, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, USB, and it has 8 gig of memory, and it's 799. You can pre-order the devices today at Q.com. Um, the shipping will be in April.